Welcome everybody. Going to be doing a bit of a review of the old um, <clears throat> Settlers 2. Doing a bit of a playthrough as well. Used to love this game back in the day. Holy moly. We're going to skip these first two because uh, they're kind of like a bit like a tutorial and whatnot. So we're just going to jump straight into uh, number three and get it going. 17th day of the third month of the third year. We have created something of a routine and establishing a viable settlement. Everything should now work like clockwork. Well, I'm not sure about that, but let's see how we go. This is how most of them start, just a little uh, a little outpost like this. You press spacebar and you can see where you can build. Normally best off just getting a bit of a uh, barracks or a guardhouse down to start expanding and we're also going to get down a bit of a couple of little woodcutters and a forester right there lovely also need a couple of fisheries Oh, there's a few animals up here as well. Let's do a bit of a hunter. Uh, we're going to speed this up by pressing V. You see the little icon pops up here. I'm not sure if it's double time or what, but if we press uh, S, we get to see uh, the status of each building, and C gives you the uh, the name of each building. Also going to get a quarry down over there. And we'll just let those uh, build up a bit. Alright, back at it. These build up a bit nicely. I'm going to get a uh, sawmill down over... Uh, Let's just destroy it up. Over here. There we go. I used to play this game like when it came out 25 years ago, whatever. Great game at the time. Great game at the time. And still still a good game, surprisingly enough. Like it's not it's not boring to play this, you know. So we're gonna expand up here, guardhouse, guardhouse, connect them back over here. Uh, a fishery should be going in a minute. It's quite a lot of animals. This hunt will be going for a little while here. Got a sawmill down. I guess I should do a farm as well. Get a farm going right now. So the key with the farms is that you want them... Like, it's the the only building that you need to kind of give a nice big area to. You don't want to build anywhere here. Ideally, you don't want to build it n right next to a forester either, but... Oh well, it'll be fine. It'll be fine! Once these guardhouses, guardhouses are down, we'll be able to build, like, we'll send out a geologist to these areas and we'll be able to build, like, mines and such over there. Because we can do gold, iron, coal, and granite. Granite is just this, it's just stone, basically, so... And it, you can do that if you're really short on stone. Which you rarely are. <laughs> Is there anything else we should be building at the moment? No. I think we're okay. Oh, it's given. It's, this is this, what it's got in our uh, headquarters. So it's given us quite a bit of uh, stuff already. Coal, iron ore, even got some gold coins there. These are all the tools for the, uh, the different buildings and such. So tongs will be for maybe metalworks. Axe will be for woodcutter. Saw will be for the sawmill. That will be for the the quarry. 
and the mines. Uh, maybe the armor smith for the hammer. Shovel be geologist, I'm guessing. And we've probably got already yeah, a few of the people. Like five builders, two planners, two woodcutters, three stonemasons, two farmers, and a shipwright. Oh, I wonder. All right, let's expand down this way. If we have a shipwright, in theory, we should be able to build the uh, <laughs> the harbour now, or or whatever it's called. Couldn't do it on the last round, but we can. Military building occupied. Lovely. That was obviously from a little while ago. These ones are almost built. And look, he's already up upgraded to whatever that is. Let's have a look. A general. Nice. Because we already had some gold coins in the headquarters this time. So that's what the coins are for. They upgrade your uh, your units. Slowly but surely. And look. Look. You see this is built and then you see the little private or whatever he is going up to occupy it and then I'll, I'll expand in a second. Lovely. Right here we go. Let's put a little flag down, connect it and send out a geologist. Kind of need to expand down this way as well. Where's the... there goes the geologist. Where's the... Oh, here we go, here's the little uh, private or whatever it is to occupy this one. Expand out that way. Farm's almost done, that's good. Cool, let's do another farm up here. I won't put any fucking forestry next to it. And fuck it up. Let's just expand straight away. We'll put a flag there and call out a geologist at the same time. Granite, don't want granite. Let's call one out there. A geologist out there as well. Everything else is going swimmingly. Woodcutters are cutting. Forester is planting. Sawmill is soaring. Love to see it. Okay, what's he found? Coal? Okay, nice. We'll get a coal mine down straight away here. You never have enough coal in these games because everything wants or uses coal. Iron smelter needs coal and iron to make the uh, iron ingots. Metalworks needs coal and iron ingot. Armory needs coal, iron ingot. Mint needs coal and gold. Yeah, so they all need coal basically. I'm just going to do another coal. Guessing we've got to build out a bit further to get something better. Oh, there we go. Yeah, okay. We're going to build up this way. To get to the iron. Farm is going. See, it's got five. Oh, that's pretty decent. It's got five. It's just a pain. And sometimes, I think, <laughs> from what I remember 25 years ago, sometimes the forester will plant a tree right in the middle of an almost ready crop. Which is... Uh, Pretty annoying, obviously. Uh, we're going to build up this way as well. Guard house to expand a bit. So pretty much just coal over in this one. And then coal and granite. Oh, and a cheeky little iron one there as well. Lovely. 
Let's get that one going. Lots of coal over here to be had. I'm going to do a little woodcutter here just to clear out this uh, this area. Some good farmland there, boy. Oh yeah, no, I can't do building landing flag. Okay. So at the start of this game had like uh, you know if you build this building we'll give you we'll give you a new building you know like if you build the uh, if you build a woodcutter then all of a sudden you automatically discover the uh, the sawmill that was like on the first tutorial second tutorial was as you expanded your lands you would find like um, uh, abandoned buildings and such and then th that would then give you the ability to uh, learn that new building I'm guessing that's where the uh, the harbour, or whatever they're going to call it, is going to be. Mm. I'm just going to wait to build another guardhouse. That one's going to expand this area a bit. He's doing up there, he's doing up there. Oh, got lots of messages. Okay, mood. Yep, military building occupied. Good. Iron found. Yeah, that's what we built. Military building occupied. Yeah, that was where I was hoping to uh, get a harbour down. Coal found, coal found, coal found. Okay, nothing exciting there. Yeah, here comes the little miner coming along. I just love the little details in this, you know. Like it's <laughs> it's so much fun. You can wa watch the little people going backwards and forwards and whatnot. And sometimes they'll uh, they'll skip rope or uh, do something else. Like wh what's this guy doing? There? Holy moly! He has a mug on him. What's wrong with his face? Why is it? Jesus Christ! Look at him. Poor chap. Holy moly. They didn't care about hit. There's two, two. <laughs> There's the, the, the big chunky face one, and then the relatively normal looking person. No women, I might add as well. Pretty, uh, pretty sexist. Pretty sexist. Okay, this road is struggling. I need to put another. So one thing you can, uh, the only way you can make the, two ways you can make the roads better in this is one, you can put another flag, so it, it turns one road into two, and then it sends out another person to stand on this road, and this is the dude who was on doing the whole road before, and another way is once it's, you know, past a certain amount of items between two points, it automatically gets fancy flags between them, and then if you have uh, pack donkeys, uh, which I don't have any of at the moment, it will then put a pack donkey in there as well, and then it's basically like two people going backwards and forwards. So this will help a little bit, putting two people in there. Uh, I need uh, to make a, a pack donkey farm at some point, uh, which I haven't done yet. I'm just going to send out a little geologist here because I just remembered I haven't got a well. I need to get a well down to get some water. Because obviously pack donkeys are going to need water. It's more food as well, I guess. Oh no, we've got quite a bit of fish and ham. Okay. And there's some meat. I need to put a... Uh, need to build a slaughterhouse, don't I? One of those lovely... Uh, yeah, I'm going to put it here. Lovely. See, see, this is what I was talking about. The flags have got upgraded here, you see? So it's a different colour road. I'm not sure if they actually walk faster along the road. I don't think it, I don't think they do. It's just a different... Mm, maybe. It's a little bit up here and down here, though. Here, here, though, so it's hard to tell. 
We'll see you on this next bit when this bit gets upgraded. Because he's going. Let's see. That was the fast little bit going down there. And then he goes really slow up there. Okay. We'll wait and see. You see. Oh, wait. The little builders just made the road better. What a fucking hero. Holy moly. There's no way to zoom in on this game, which is a bit annoying. The only way to zoom in is like the observation window, which is, uh, <laughs> yeah, not great. Okay, nice. Expand it out that way. Okay, still going to have to expand down this way as well a bit. Lovely. Don't want to connect it onto the farm because it needs as many, uh, it needs as much space around it as possible. And if you put a road there, it might just take out one of those. Okay, good, good. I might just put back donkey farm down now, just to uh, a donkey breeder. There we go, donkey breeder. Uh, and I need a couple of welds. Oh, I've kind of put this right where. Okay, I'm going to destroy that quick. Okay, I'll take a risk and just put the bow here. I think it's going to be fine anyway. Lovely. Uh, probably need two of those, don't I, actually? Okay, we've expanded it that way as well. Hold on! I'll do well there. Lovely. Okay. These boys need some food to get working. There we go. Is a fish coming for him? Oh, it went to his mate. Went to his mate. Next time you'll get some food, mate, I'm sure. Let's just check the uh, distribution of goods, food stuff, gold mine, iron mine, coal mine. So the iron mine should be getting the food. Like for a 25 year old game, to have this kind of, you know, customizability is actually pretty, uh, pretty decent, I think. I want it on the, the previous round, one of the th tutorials, I had run out of food in my coal mine, I think it was, so I had to change the... Uh, I had to take it away from the gold and put it into the coal because I didn't have any coal left anywhere. So I might have to do that later on in this round as well. But we'll see. <laughs> Look how fast this well <laughs> built because it's a small building and it's right next to the headquarters. Still quite a lot of fish there, that's good. I think I'm going to build another fishery up here just to get that going. Hmm, I better put a little flag in between there. It's a very long road I've done there. Give this man some food! Oh, here's got some food. You alright? Why are you saying 0%? Greedy beggar. Okay, let's do a... A mill and a bakery up here. Mm, just connect those together. Mm. Is this okay? Because what we can do, we can build a uh, a storehouse, which kind of acts like another headquarters, basically, and we can put that wherever we want. I just don't think. We're far enough away from everything here yet. Should we go a bit further? Hmm. I think it's okay for the moment. It's okay. Okay, expanded down there. Uh, yes, that's that one. Oh, we expanded up as well. Good. Yeah, and to the left there. And to the right. Look at this. A little reminder that you haven't saved your game. Lovely. Let me save. Boom saved in that third slot. 
Let's send out a geologist over here. Because we need some other bits and pieces, don't we? We need gold! Gold. And more iron. Coal will be okay with for the moment. We've got, yeah, we've got 40 coal for the moment. You see, look, it still gives you the option to build, like, right here around the farm. But we don't want to do that. Come on, donkey breeder. So we'll see very shortly, hopefully. Donkeys getting produced from this donkey breeder here. And then they'll go straight onto these roads up here. And then they'll get rid of this backlog. So you can't work fast enough. Let's see. What do you think? Is that going faster? Hmm. It's hard to tell. Not fast enough to clear the black backlog anyway, so... Right, we need to expand. We are not expanding right now. Oh, there's an iron one there. Boom, iron. Okay, guardhouse there. Guardhouse. Let's do it here, because that's just the edge of nothing. You pull down that part, flag and pull down that flag so we can see what's going on better. I'm just going to build these two for the moment. I'm not going to bother connecting them right now so they don't get built. But th these little uh, signs vanish after like 10 minutes or so. So if, if I've just built these, then I know where the, uh, the resources are at. And I don't need to send out the geologist again. Perfect. All right, we need to expand this way as well. Let's just put one right down here for the moment. That should bump us up into here, and then we can do one in the middle in between those two. We need to expand this way as well. Let's go there. Yeah, that's a good spot. Okay. Look, look, look. We've got a donkey. Go, donkey, go. Yes. <clears throat> Brilliant. Wait, there's still a backlog. Up here now. Well, he's not even moving. Where's he trying to take it to? Oh, the backlog's here now. I can't even put another little road in there. Okay, this hunter looks like he's run out of food. He's had a good run. I'm just going to get rid of that. Can't do anything now. To improve the road, I don't think. Okay, you know what, I'm going to build a storehouse up here, right, we're having issues. Mm, where to build it?
A little woodcutter to come and chop down some of these freaking trees that are in the way, don't we? Let's do that first, shall we? Oh, it's quite quick to... Look, we should see a baker coming out. Look at him with his, <laughs> his fancy hat and his rolling pin. Don't know if we... Yes! <laughs> he's not even started work, he's already a bit overweight. Chunky monkey. Oh wait. I didn't even connect this. Other one's connected? Yeah, okay, good. It's just that one. This music is very dated, but it's <laughs> relatively catchy. <laughs> okay. Just clearing those notifications. Alright, let's build another little woodcutter up here just to clear this bit of area as well. Lovely. This woodcutter has just moved in. So hopefully he's going to uh, get rid of some of these trees for us. So get the storehouse down just where I want it. Could do it here. Mm, let's do it next to the main road. Because it's already been upgraded all the way up to there. And I could even put in... Oh, I should do. I should put another flag in there. Because look, there's a backlog. So they should send out, should send out another little man. For this bit. Oh! There's a little private. He's going to go and occupy. Here we go, up over here. Lovely. So this bottom bit's been occupied. And we are going to get another guardhouse down here, I think. Yes, perfect. Glad the trees weren't blocking the, uh, the road there. Okay, we're just going to go straight north from this one. And he's just moved in a bit. It looks like it's going to be the sea just up here, isn't it? Hmm. Oh well. I guess we got to do it. Otherwise we'll never know. Expand up that way as well. More granite here, which is good. What was on these? Is this going to be gold? Gold in them there hills. Let's hope so. Not found any gold yet. So we've got two iron mines, four coal mines going at the moment. I don't know if it is stonemasons, to be honest. It must be, right? Oh, no, there it is. Miner. Miner there. So, six mines is the maximum. If we want more, we need to get a metalworks going. Okay, expanding, expanding. He's almost done. Expanding. Good. Okay, we can get the storehouse down just where I want it now, which is good. Boom. Perfect. I should really put another storehouse this side as well somewhere. Just depends which way they go though. Uh, let's wait and see where these expand to and then decide because it could be this could be the main road or this could be the main road going out depending on what the island shape is. Yeah, I mean... Yeah. <laughs> Detail, he's right. 